DC Universe Online is one of my favorite video games from my childhood and today I want to revisit it and see if it's as good as I remember it being, to see if anything changed and to see if I would play it all over again. So let's jump into it. Also yes, I have a lisp in this video because I just got retainers. So stop writing your comments about it. Watch out Superman, watch out Wonder Woman, watch out Batman. There's a new superhero in town and he goes by the name Yagro. <laughs> I gotta come up with a backstory for this guy. Now, I don't know if you guys ever played this game before. If you go to like a police station or like anywhere, there's always just a bunch of random people just standing around like this. Now, like it's only like two of them, so it's not, not like not really proving anything, but they're always just standing there. And it's not like that they're away or anything. Be okay, well now Mary Marvel just went away. But like they, they usually just be standing there for no reason. This is a bad example. I'll show you guys later what I mean. Now, this was like one of my like most favorite games of all time. This game was like my life. Let me show you how many hours I have in this game. If you guys look at the bottom right corner, I have 682 hours in this game. That's a lot. All right, this game basically was my life for like a majority of like my early teenage years. All right, Grodd, there's a new hero in town and I'm gonna stop you. Shut your s- Hey, guess what? I got guns now. I don't even think I'm hitting them. I, I really, like, they really, like, updated this game a little bit with, like, the UI and stuff. Like, I never really told you when you leveled up. It did, like, the animation, but it didn't say at the top of your screen like that. All right. Don't worry, citizen. I saved you. Why am I killing you? I don't know. I just feel like it. This outfit is really fitting. It's kind of like an optical illusion. Like, from the back, it makes me look longer than I really am. Like, does it look, does it look like that for you guys, too, or is it just me? There you go. Level six, baby. Yeah, let's do this. Yo, is that the real yeah, Superman calling me? How did Superman get my number? Yo, Superman, we should like chill one day. It'd be pretty cool, I think. I hope they end up making like a DC Universe 2 or something like that. I would love to play this game with like updated graphics. That would be insane. And like like new movement and like, just like making super speed actually super speed. Cause I'm pretty sure super speed ain't even the fastest movement in the game. Basically the slowest. And then Batman has the fastest movement. Acro How is acrobatics faster than flying and super speed? That makes no sense to me. I want to be able to fly like subsonic speeds and run light speed and then acrobatics can just like, you know, just continue running, I guess. <laughs> Slowly but surely getting all these humans back to normal. I'll save you, human. Why are you walking like that, bro? Walk normally. Come on, man. Okay, there we go. We're meeting up with Gorilla Grodd now. Ah, uh, so you guys are the ones in my way. I'll stop you. <laughs> Why am I walking like this? Bro, these, these like dialogue lines are like becoming so nostalgic. Like I can, I can remember, I remember these lines by heart. Like the Gorilla Grodd speech we're about to hear, I could probably say it by heart. I mean, I'll probably miss a couple words, but like I kind of remember most of the words he says. Oh my, it's him, it's him. Oh, he looks different. This is not the same Flash outfit he had before. Let me see if I can pull up a picture of him, how he looks before. Cause that is a new flash outfit. That's kind of cool. Tremble before Grodd. Bro, this is like, it's like a, it's like a song you've heard a million times before for a guy like me. I know these, I know these like lines of dialogue, bro. I played this game so many times. It's great. I love this game. I, I think it's aged pretty decently well. Like if I could go back and like play this for the first time all over again, I would. Hey yo, Flash, you know, after this, I think it'd be pretty cool if you like gave me an autograph and you know, after we like stopped Gorilla Grodd and all, like, you know, I, I'm, a, I'm a really big fan of you. We did it, let's go, we're, we're those guys. Hey, Flash, we make a great team. Hey yo, Flash, again, you know, we, we were a great team, you know. I think we should have more team ups like that more often. I think that was great. Bro, I love the suit he has here. I want it. I'm, I'm just gonna take it from your body. I'm just gonna take it. I'm just gonna take it. I don't want my own, I'm gonna take yours. All right, now that we had a little stroll down memory lane by making like our own character, I'm gonna show you guys like, all right, so look, as you guys can see, level 30, level 30, level, like all of them are level 30, that's the max level. And then this is like my highest level one. I play this game a lot. And I, I'm just, I just like, since I've completed the game on these, I just wanna like go through and just like, and just show you guys like what I'm talking about, you know? Basically what I'm saying, but people just be like kind of standing around for no reason. This is how people play this game. Like I just imagine someone just walks into their room and then they're just sitting there, just like looking at their screen, just looking at them standing around. They like ask them, bro, what are you doing? And then they're like, oh, I'm playing DC Universe online. And then they look at the screen and just see this. And they're like, you're just standing around. And then they just say, yep and just continue staring at the screen. That's what I imagine what happens when people like walk into the room. So, this makes no sense to me. Why do people do this? I have no idea. They added a new map, Dakota City. Hold on, this is new. I'm curious. What is this song? Dakota City got a nice soundtrack. Okay, let me see what this place is all about. I've never been here before. It kind of just looks like Metropolis. Is this like another earth or something? Why is this music actually good? Oh, we got static shock and, 
and steel. Cyborg 2? Yo, Cyborg. I'm a big fan. I know I'm a super villain and stuff, but like, I'm a big fan. Blue Beetles here. Oh, yeah. So they did update this game a little bit. Okay, this is something like only true OGs that played this game before. So if you guys played this game before, let me know down below. Did you guys ever do this? Like a long time ago, back in the day, there would always be like parties going on back here. Like legitimate parties. Like people would just write in chat, be like, yo, what's up? We got a party going on here. Pull to Lex Luthor's tower. And then they would just have like a whole party right here. And it was kind of fire. I'm not going to lie. There would be like, like 20, 30 people here. And it, it was kind of fun. But like, that's, that's something that happened way, way back then. I don't, I don't even think that happens anymore. Just because I don't know what be going on in this game anymore. I don't even play this game anymore. But yeah, it's kind of cool to see that people still play this game. I have a lot of fond memories with this game. Playing it with my friends. Like, you know, doing a bunch of raids and stuff. And just like suffering for hours. It was so fun. But that was way back then. You know, we all grew up. Now we do our own things like I'm doing YouTube now. Hopefully, eventually maybe, I'll get a thousand subscribers. You can help by subscribing. So, yeah, subscribe to the channel. And help me get to a thousand subscribers. But uh, yeah, that was that was fun. I missed this game and uh, I'll see you guys next time. Peace.